Alright, what's up guys, today we're doing a video on how to remove a Linux dual boot from your Windows computer. Alright, so first thing you want to do is when you uh, first start your computer and you get the Grub bootloader, uh, go to your Windows uh, install and hit enter, and wait for that to load. Alright, once you're in Windows, what you want to do is you want to click on the start button in the bottom left hand corner, uh, click on the power button and hold shift and click restart. And it will say please wait. Alright, after that's done, uh, you'll be greeted by this screen and you want to click troubleshoot, advanced options, Command prompt, and wait for your computer to reboot. After your computer reboots, you'll be greeted by the Grub bootloader again. Simply go down to your Windows install and click, uh, hit enter on that. After that's done, simply choose the account you want to use. I'm going to choose my main account on this Windows computer, which is the only one on the list. Uh, enter your password if you have one. All right, now once you're here, what you want to do is you want to type in boot rec space forward slash fix MBR, hit enter, and boot rec space fix boot and hit enter. After that's done, uh, you can close out of the window and click exit and continue to Windows. Next time your computer starts booting, you'll notice that the Grub bootloader didn't come up this time, but there's one final step which we have to do to remove Linux. Alright, so once you've loaded back into Windows, you want to go into the start menu and type in disk mgmt.msc and hit enter. And then once this loads, uh, you want to find the drive where you've installed Linux on, and you want to locate the partitions where you've installed Linux. So here are the two partitions um, which I've installed Linux onto, and what you want to do here is you want to right click on each one, hit delete volume, hit yes, and then do the same thing with the other one. And you'll be left with this green free space here. Click on the green free space, right click and press delete partition. And then you have some black unallocated space. From here you can click on your Windows install, right click on it, click extend volume, simply click next, next, finish and it will fill the rest of the remaining space. All right, so that's how you remove a Linux dual boot on your Windows computer. I hope you all enjoyed this video, and if you want to see more content like this, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one.